Hello, I'd like to welcome all to welcome all back to Castlevania Circle of the Moon! The moon! Oh man, I love the moon. I think the moon's a great invention of mankind. I'll see you when we get to the point that we can actually do stuff, because I should be down there in that, that place over there. You can see it on the map. We'll get there. This is it. No, 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 I'm supposed to be one floor down. Okie doke. So I looked it up. I think experience is linear. It does not decrease over time like it does in Sotten. I also learned that apparently your familiars can level up in Sotten. That's a great thing that I should have known long, long, long ago. Preferably in the land before time. Yeah. So because experience never decreases... Oh, we can't get up. Wait a s Am I supposed to go up there? Because there's a road that goes up there. See, this is why you use save states. It allows you to quickly go back without having to load saves. It does mean, however, that I have the wrong cards equipped. Look how a guy asked me about it. Do you know about the glitch? Yes, because I performed it in the first episode! <laughs> oh man, put a little bit of effort forward before you start asking. Fuck yeah. Oh, look! Ooh, ooh, look at that defense! I'm a tank! Hmm. I see it, I see it. I remember there being a place to go down there, but I forgot exactly where it was. Heart max increases! like the golem card, but I can't be sure. Look how long that takes. Gee willikers, Batman, we sure are up there. See, I keep saying that the biggest uh, deal breaker with this uh, ability, uh, with the DSS, is that it's really slow and clunky and it doesn't have to. Oh, there's a floor down here. And there's my prize! HP Max! Yeah! I pay a couple of Benjamins for that. So a guy actually explained to me why this guy has the vampire killer whip thing. I don't give a shit. What I care about is that he's not a Beaumont. Also, who the fuck calls their whip the vampire killer? 
And why don't those things have a cooldown, like they have in Sotten, where it's like, for a few seconds, you don't pick it back up again. We should be... yes. And now we can open this door. Yes! I don't know why you always get to unlock the first one in these games via this fashion. It's like, oh, go through the door. Oh, look, we're here again. And it's always in earlier areas that you know what just happened. Yeah, that ice whip had a really low cooldown. Oh yeah, yeah, it's telling me about the electric skeletons having the card, but we already picked up that card. MP Max! And here's the save room. Probably should do two save states. One for quick loading of saves themselves, and one for... POTION! Sweet deal, Ruby Bleal! That was a bad idea. Regardless of what my plan was. Cross is going to be great against the Necromancer. Though I don't know what he's weak against. Running down the hall! Wow, he has such a bad animation. It's so choppy. Quotation marks go left. But if I remember. Give me a moment. I want to see, because I didn't actually see that. I just knew it was there beforehand. Yeah, that one doesn't seem to be visible at all. Except that small chip in the block. That Like that little thing. Look where his hand is. This tiny fucking chip in that block. How the hell are you supposed to see that? I don't care about the stupid drop rates right now. I gotta pick up my MP. Plus. Yeah! I don't think we can go over here yet until we pick up the, uh, you get to jump better now. Yeah, we need the wall jump, I think. Yeah, wall jump. Which is really bad, by the way. It is, it feels so stiff for a wall jump, which should feel smooth and sexy. Like spanking the baby when it gets out of the womb. There's another hard plus up there, but no idea how to get there. Without the wall jump, that is. Cotton clothes! Guess it already has his cottonest clothes. Why's this guy up here even? Two hits now, do we? Don't worry, this usually saves point before the boss. Is there anything here worth no, there's nothing here. It's all me now.
Oh, if it's to the left, we can get another blockade. As you can see, that's the hallway we tried before. There was a block in the way. All we get to do now is fight the boss, and I guess we'll do that, because they didn't pick up any cards. And I won't have anything to title the, <laughs> the video with if I don't kill a boss first. I hope this cross thing works out for me. Now that I mind, actually, the Necromancer boss isn't too difficult until the second phase. I think his first phase is kind of alright. Look at all those devil towers. No, actually, the axe would be a better choice, but... There's a few reasons not to use the axe. Okay, no. Let me give me a moment. Fart joke. Let's go. He walks very confidently. Extraordinary. Now then, let's pick the most beneficial power. Twenty-four. It's very... It's very snappy. Very snappy, I've noticed. Okay, eighteen. I think fire might be it. Though... Fire is the way to go. Toad's not fair, bro. Toad's not fair! Oh, fuck, I hate this move. Let's see if the corridor's a good place to hide. Look at that fucking cross doing its job! Look at that cross! It's just fucking awesome! Nobody messes with the Kabloom Boomerang. Fucking love that idea. That was a lot easier than I thought! Didn't even have to save Scum. Although I had to do it in the original fight, but it doesn't use elemental attacks, and it's pretty weak, comparatively. That is a crappy sound effect. It sounds like someone just broke on the floor. It's like, <laughs> I'm sorry, sir. I just collapsed on the floor. Mind picking me up again? I think I got to level up out of that, too. Sweet deal, bro. I think now our goal is to, let's see. Yeah, we go up the tower, which means I'm going to make a teeny tiny bit of progress. Although, I could just take the save. No, it's actually slower, technically, because I want to save first. Talk to the cross is fucking awesome. And I figured out that I was out of... Heart ammo when I try to use it. By the way, let's switch back to luck. The only stat that really matters. Yeah, what you gonna do, boy? What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Oh, I love how he bounces off. It's so fucking dumb. Dude, trying to get me out of my cross? Trying to decross me, bro, 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 bro. 
Sweet, an antidote. So, unlike Castlevania, this game, by the way, has very set level ups. And there's actually a system for each and every class that you can use. It's pretty fucking weird. What's gonna do, bro? You wanna bro down, bro? You wanna bro, 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 flow? Oh, he wants to flow with the bro. He thinks he's hot potatoes. Let me check the map real quick to see if there's a save point. There's a save point, not too far from that point. So how about we make some progress? Tiny little baby progress. That's, that is. Oh, mouse cursor. Oh, fuck. I think it's almost off screen, actually. No? I don't know. Oh, it's fine. Although I might die on the way there. Ah, prison garb. Too bad I have bronze armor, or I'd be very interested. Goddamn person whose attack is just slapping into me. Wrong floor. I was wondering where that block was. really have to, I can just gulp down a potion. Oh, fuck! Guess what just dawned to me? We're gonna have to fight Heat Spirit soon, which means I'm gonna have to swap to Ice Attacks. Because fuck it if I'm gonna fight a Heat Shade. Oh no, it's a Zimbambo thief. How does he steal anything as a Zimbambo? A Zamboni. A Zamboner. A Zombier. That's a game. It is now. Now there is some stuff over there, but I don't think we can pick it up anyway, so who cares? Not to mention right now, to me, a save point is much more benefit. Ah, oh, yeah, extra stats. Nothing makes me happy like a level up. Oh my god, this is such running music. Such music, you just want to run circles like a derp. Never heard this, actually, because I turned the sound down because I was bored. So, you might notice we picked up some cotton clothes and... Cotton robe, which in drastically increases our int, which I think is our... Um, I don't know what it does, actually. Let me look it up real lickety split. Circle of the moon stats. No, I just wanna know what they do. Stats and leveling to see what each does. Let's see, strength increases your damage, defense increases your defense, Ugh. increases the speed of your MP recovery? Oh wow, so I can get one more MP per second? I don't give a damn! Oh yeah, I forgot how I mapped my buttons. So next time! Probably gonna get some more cards. Let's have a look see. Oh, it looks like we're getting some new cards. Those look like some exciting new cards. And then we get to fight a giant iron golem. But until then, do not forget, the only way to fling your weapon in a circle is to jerk your arm back arm back and forth like you've got a spasm. The whip animation is good, but his arm looks just like he's going nuts. Look at that poise. Bet you it takes a dragon's tooth to knock him out of that one. 